Hello and welcome to the Daily Forex Report for December 15th. We are looking at the U.S. Japanese Yen pair. This pair moved to the downside. We are looking for it to uh, continue tracking sideways, potentially going as high as 78.46, possibly as low as 77.42. Look for some resistance around 78.15 and look for some support around 77.75. Now the Euro USD pair, this pair created an inside bar during this last session, closed higher. We are looking for it to potentially go as high as 1.3129, possibly as low as 1.2858. Look for some resistance around 1.3063 and look for some support around 1.2945. Now the pound US dollar pair, this pair closed higher during this last session, did create an inside bar. We are looking for it to potentially go as high as 156.27, possibly as low as 153.49. Look for some resistance around 155.32 and look for some support around 154.31. Now the U.S. Swiss, this pair closed down, moved strong to the downside. We are looking for it to potentially go as high as 196.30, possibly as low as 092.49. Look for some resistance around 0, 94.75 and look for some support around 0, 93.38. Okay, well that wraps up uh, that portion. Let me get this off the screen here. Uh, we are looking for uh, the U.S. to release their consumer price index for November at 8.30 a.m. Eastern Time. Consensus on that one is the same as the previous at 3.5%. Okay, what am I looking for as far as trades go? If you go over to the U.S.-Japanese yen pair, you can see that uh, we had basically a trend line here, one, two, three. It got broken today. Uh, however, I don't... Uh, let's move this down to here. If you look at where price is currently, around the 77.75 mark, 79 right now. Um, if we break through this, I could see it heading lower. Now, how, you know, where could it potentially go? Uh, we have this area, but I think it'll get even lower. I think you could look to squeeze, you know, 30 pips out of it, uh, potentially, and using the high today of 15. So a, a, a two to one ratio as far as stop loss to take profit. So again, that would be a short around the 77.74 mark, and then look to exit around the 77.50 mark. Putting a stop loss right above the high here, 15 pip stop loss, 30 pip take profit. Hope that helps, and until next time, this is Jason Filder. Good trading.